Last year's historic wildfire season, Oregon State leaders say they have made changes. And now they're getting ready for the season ahead. Lindsay Nadridge, live with what we can expect. Lindsay, what are they saying about what could happen this summer? Well, the state fire marshals said they're looking at fires in a different way this year and say there's already concern given how many fires we've already seen this year that have threatened communities. The Oregon Department of Forestry says Oregon is expected to have hotter than normal temperatures over the next few months and lower than normal rain, so conditions are worrisome. At the top of everyone's mind, could we see a repeat of last year when more than a million acres burned, thousands were evacuated, and and air quality was the worst anyone can remember. Here's part of how Doug Kraft with the Oregon Department of Forestry answered that question. Now, last year's uh, September events uh, were unprecedented. Uh, what we refer to this as uh, a, an alignment of forces uh, for a unique weather event. Graf said they are paying attention to any weather event that comes close to what happened last year, but said he's more concerned about significant dry lightning events the state sees every year. State leaders also said they've made updates to notification systems to better alert people in an emergency. Power companies say they've also put in place new steps to lessen the impact from wildfires and are working closer with fire departments to shut off power ahead of any weather events. That's something many said didn't happen soon enough last year. Year. I'll have more, much more on this coming up at five, along with what you can do now to make sure you're prepared for wildfire season. Reporting live, I'm Lindsay Natterich, Coin Six News. Okay.